Hi guys, in this video tutorial I'm going to make a review on Safari 4.0 beta. Okay, first of all, uh, as you can see I have a new wallpaper, a new theme. That is because my computer got formatted and uh, I just didn't want to uh, install the Windows 7 one as I'll get a newer computer and better one, even cheaper as well, uh, very soon. So I'll install it on there. Okay, so let's just get on to the point. Uh, you can get Safari 4.0 on Apple's website. Okay, let's just go over uh, the important stuff. Uh, this is the interface. I really like it because here is the t uh, here are the tabs. Here is the t here is the tabs bar. Just click the plus, it divides up in two, and 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 you get this top sites with all your top visited sites and how they look. Uh, let's just go on YouTube for example. And it gets over there pretty fast. I say, I mean, this is maybe even faster than Firefox. I haven't tested yet, but it is really, really fast. Uh, you can move around the tab by clicking the little handle. Then you can move it around. And if you take it down, it becomes a separate window. But I prefer having things in tabs. Okay, so how to get Safari? Really simple. All you have to do is just go on apple.com and then download. You can also follow the link in the description. Take Safari 4.0 beta and it says the world's fastest browser. Not sure about that but yeah 50% maybe even 60%. Download now you should get a setup file, install all of that and it should be done. Okay it looks really a lot like Chrome. I mean you have your tabs and all this. I mean this and this, you know, this and well, this really this is the only difference between Google Chrome, I think, and also this bar because the settings and stuff really looks the same. And also, this one I mean, it really looks as Google Chrome, but I prefer the tabs and it's faster. Also, the normal bookmarks as uh, Safari always has, and uh, to customize, you can just uh, click this setting thing. And then customize toolbar. You can add autofill, all of those things. And uh, you have customized toolbar. Uh, yeah, that's what we just did. Show menu bar. You have all of this history. I don't like this because it takes off the space, and because Safari is so good with taking or saving space, I prefer you're saving as much as possible. Uh, except I really like bookmarks. Also, you have download manager as well, private browsing. Uh, I'm not going to say the whole wor word, but this is actually P mode, and uh, it doesn't save any of your history of, at all. Reset Safari, block pop up windows, preferences. You have your Mac style settings. Uh, with appearance here, you have font smoothing. I prefer having it on light. Uh, if you want to uh, uh, smooth out your fonts on your whole computer, I have a tutorial on that called Mac like font smoothing in Windows. It really helps. Uh, one thing, or two things I really like about it is the zoom I just showed you. You can zoom in, you can zoom out. Uh, you can also do it by on the keyboard. It's really simple. Just hold control at the wheel on your mouse. Uh, if you say you want to go up on a page, that's zooming out. Zooming in is going down on the page. So if I zoom in, I'm going down. If I zoom out, I'm going in. It's really weird, but uh, I really like the zoom uh, effect. But what I really like is history. So this is my uh, browsing history for last visited today. That's all I've been on today. And it has the cover flow of a Mac and of a uh, as called iTunes. I really like it because it's more responsive than iTunes. Because iTunes is really slow. You you know, you know, you click something. It takes a lot of time for it to respond. All of that stuff. I really like it. I really like the history thing. And you can customize it size. I just drag now. When you select something, it automatically select it. It selects it from this whole group and you can also have previews that's uh, well the point of it and you can search here 
So you can search for anything that's been written here. So let's just say uh, FF Comp Help FF YouTube. So let's just type in. Uh, whoop! Didn't want to do that there. You just type in. Uh, whoop! What's going on? Uh, FF Comp Help. FF. You know all those who have uh, FF Comp Help FF as title. Here, well, that doesn't even have it. Wow, you know, all these things, all that, and I, I, I really like it. I mean, Safari is really, really good, it's really, really fast. All of that search history, all RSS feeds, bonjour, all those things, whatever. Uh, basically, the other things, um, uh, was it? <coughs> Sorry, guys, I'm sick. Uh, I mean, I'd rate this four and a half because I don't really the ease and customization is not as is not as customizable as Firefox. Uh, no, no, Firefox gets four and a half, and Fi uh, Safari gets four because the toolbar here or the bookmarks not as easy to organize. Uh, also, there are no add-ons. There are no themes, as a uh, as I know of. So, mm, that's a solid four. And I mean, I'm pretty tough with web browsers. We uh, Internet Explorer, that's a solid zero. So, yeah, I'm pretty hard in web browsers. And uh, yeah, that's basically Safari, guys. Thank you for watching. Please comment this video if you have any questions. Please rate it five stars if you liked it. Uh, rate under five stars if you didn't. And of course, subscribe to my videos. It will help me very much. Also, please check out my partners' channels, Alex LA09 and Tech Eclipse. Thanks for watching.